the second-degree murder trial of George Zimmerman for killing unarmed African-American teenager Trayvon Martin has opened in Florida. During opening statements Monday, attorneys on each side cast conflicting views of Zimmerman's motives on the night of the shooting last February. Prosecutor John Guy said Zimmerman, a Neighborhood Watch volunteer, had profiled the 17-year-old as suspicious and chose to assume the role of a police officer and follow him. He quoted Zimmerman's own expletive lace words to a dispatcher. Good morning. Good morning. Pumps. These they always get away. Those were the words in that grown man's mouth as he followed in the dark a 17-year-old boy who he didn't know. And excuse my language, but those were his words. Not mine. These were Prosecutor John Guy's concluding remarks at the end of his opening statement Monday. We are confident that at the end of this trial, you will know in your head, in your heart, in your stomach, that George Zimmerman did not shoot Trayvon Martin because he had to. He shot him for the worst of all reasons, because he wanted to. Thank you for your time. Defense lawyer Don West argued George Zimmerman killed Trayvon Martin because he feared for his life after the teenager smashed Zimmerman's head on the sidewalk, which he suggested constituted a deadly weapon. West told a knock-knock joke toward the beginning of his remarks, a move for which he later apologized. Knock-knock. Who's there? George Zimmerman. George Zimmerman who? All right, good. You're on the jury. Nothing? That's funny. 